Hey, what's up, guys? ALW here, back for another video. Today, I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing three of the figures out of my birthday haul. Bianca Belair, Series 81, Jerry the King Lawler, Series 82, and Alexa Bliss from Series 82. First, let's start off with the Bianca Belair. So here's the figure in its packaging. We get the figure itself, sunglasses, these hands, which are like that, these hands punch, and a cloth, I believe, or like a cloth jacket. There's the back. The rest of the series, we have The Rock, Shinsuke, Angelo Dawkins, Montez Fours, Ford, Stunning, Stunning Steve Austin, and Bianca Belair. If you want to read the back side, it's her with her glasses. And on the other side, it's a photo of her. All right, let's get into the unboxing. First, let's go over the accessories. Um, these hands. Sorry, fist hands. Her glasses. And this, like, leathery jacket. It says EST with her lips. Or, not with her lips, but her lips. And then it's just a bunch of photos, like, cartoons of her with pink sleeves. Uh, to describe the material, it's kind of like the Matt Riddle swimsuit jacket. It's kind of like a leather. It's kind of like the Becky Lynch jacket. It's just like a... Not necessarily leather, but it feels like leather. Now for the figure itself. Um, so the head scan, I don't know how I feel about it. It looks, it doesn't really look like her. Um, like, I don't know, it just, it looks like her, but it doesn't look like her. I don't know how to explain it. It's a very small figure, but that's how all women elites are. <clears throat> the hair is pretty long, so it might get in the way of your playing if that worries you. But if it's just for posing, it's a pretty it's a pretty good figure. Her attire is basically just lip prints and like a cartoon version of herself, kinda like the same thing with the jacket. And she has her lip tattoos on their back. And her hair says EST for established. Which is a pretty cool detail. Um, not much going on with this figure. But some black and silver boots. The hey, uh, I think the biggest complaint would either be the head scan. Which I guess isn't too bad. Or the fact that there's this like, it's her hair. And I know that that's how she uses it. She kind of uses it in the ring as a technique. But it might get annoying to play with. But that's the Bianca Blair figure and her accessories. Next up, Alexa Bliss from Series 82. On the side, it has her. On the back, the rest of the series, which is Keith Lee, Finn Balor, John Morrison, Alexa Bliss, Rob Gronkowski, and Jerry the King Lawler. Um, if you want to read that, there you go. Another photo of her. And I think this figure is going to be a really, really good add to the collection. Because I have been in need of an Alexa Bliss Elite. I've always been using the basic. And it is not. It, it's just. It doesn't really work well. So let's get into it. So first the accessories. She comes with two of these mic holding hands. And one half of the women's tag team champion. This is a white title belt with gold. And like silver print. I don't know if you can see that if it will focus, but it says women's tag team champions. The other, the only way to get the second one is with um the Sasha Banks Elite. I forget what series that in that's in, but I might buy it with my money and post a review on it. Maybe because I would really like that figure. It'd be an updated Sasha Banks for me. I do have an Elite, but it's kind of old and it doesn't articulate well. But here is the Alexa Bliss Elite figure. Heads, this head scan is really, 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 really good. It really looks like her. The attire is great. Um, I kind of wish, because on these um, open hands, there are skull gloves. But on uh, my holding hands, there's no gloves. I know that's kind of asking for much, but it would have been pretty cool. Her attire is like a black, pink, and lime green kind of thing going on um there's not really not really like like the basic her t-shirt had her on it and like 
a lot of other details going around. This is just kind of just her basic attire. She doesn't have the pigtails. She just has her normal long hair with the pink tips. Um, but other than that, it is a pretty good, pretty good figure. It's going to be a really good upgrade compared to the basic, so, yeah. Now, finally, for the last figure in the, um, three-figure unboxing or review, our biggest yet, first half of the birthday celebration, or birthday haul, I guess you could call it. Um, I'm really excited for this figure. Because one of my favorite wrestlers is Jerry the King Lawler. I think he's a great commentator. And his character is really, really, really good. Sorry. I have to, oh, crap. I have to reposition the camera. There we go. Okay, if you want to read that. There you go. Picture him on the side. Picture him on the side. Let's get into this unboxing. For the accessories, he comes with two fist hands this blue crown really really cool crown i will now have three crowns with king corbin hacksaw jim and jerry the king and this beautiful beautiful cape or robe or i don't know what you want to call it but it is really heavily detailed and it's like most most cloth robes but i mean like this is probably one of my best robes it just has the crown logos here and on the white part on the top, it's just a bunch of these, like, sparkly things in different designs. And it's really, really nice. It's tied here. I think you can untie it. But what I would do, I would just slip it over the head. I wouldn't want to untie it and have to retie it every single time. It might be easier, but it would take a lot of time. This is a really, really, really cool accessory. Okay, here is the figure. Really nice figure. A leotard over the white pants with this pretty cool design crown on the boots pretty cool print design on the elbow pad the head scan is pretty pretty good looks a lot like him haircuts pretty cool and you know i really think that this figure is going to open a lot of possibilities as far as matches i can use him as a commentator i could use him as like an interviewer i or i could just you know use him as jerry the king lawler but I've always liked Jerry the King Lawler. I think his character is really cool. And he's a really good commentator. And it's a pretty good figure. Thank you guys for watching. These are really great three figures. Um, I, Tomorrow is my real birthday. So that's when I'll be getting the rest of the figures. So there might be uploads going up tonight. I meant tomorrow night. If not tomorrow night, the next day. But thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. Actually, don't make sure. If you want to, you probably don't enjoy this content. But if you do, I, it's highly appreciated. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.